immovable objects such as Edward Carpentier and Skull Murphy trade for jumping holes in Philadelphia Sports Arena. Fans can expect lots more than a fun-filled night of grunts and groans. Carpentier, the Intercounted Champion of Europe, is a popular favorite in this country and can be put on to give a powerful exhibition in the ring. Skull Murphy, the popular villain of pro wrestling, is noted for his unethical conduct in the ring. Murphy makes no bones about it once he plants that steel dome in Landon's head. His activities outside the ring are of great interest to the fans. We don't mind chatting with Skull, but it usually winds up in a boisterous, defiant oration. It's a one-fall, 30-minute foul. Carpentier hustles Murphy to the ropes, where there's three steps between these muscular matmen, but Skull slips a quick right thing to Carpentier on the break. Edward's unhappy about being mistreated as he takes his grievance out on the referee. He'll turn. While the referee's flat on his back, Murphy decides for a and serve as the umpire. It's strike one as Skull has to crack the to the canvas, and the European champ knows he has a really tough nut to crack at night. Edward isn't accustomed to this Murphy madness as he gives the villain a piece of his mind that really drives the point home. By now, Skull feels as if he just got off the book, or shall we say, out from under it. For some unknown reason, the European grappler is hitting out too well with the mediator in this debate. And the two men decide to iron out their differences right here and now. While Carpentier is engaged in public debate, watch how Skull Murphy makes the most of the situation. Man positions himself so as to take advantage of the element of surprise. He slugs Carpentier from behind, and Edward is down from the bluff. Give way. Murphy wants to end it all here and now, but Carpentier is determined not to fight to Murphy's underhanded tactics, even if there is a lot of going on. Carpentier finally gets free, but Murphy has an idea that he thinks will really swing. It does. Right in his own face as Edward drops the unsuspecting skull with a smashing kick off the rope. Edward follows up with a flying drop, kick back, and applies a leg stretch that has Murphy tied up in knots. It's side up and upside down as Carpenter pins Skull Murphy for the three count, and in this case, it's closed. And Joe Hart Carpenter sets his sights on a rematch with Buddy Rogers and for the undisputed championship for the wrestling world. 